When it comes to picking out outfits for your senior portraits, the options can seem endless. In the end, you really want to choose clothes that show your own style and personality. So in this tutorial, I'm going to give you tips on what to wear and what not to wear to your senior portraits. First off, choose clothing that you feel represents you. What makes you feel confident? What flatters you? What do you feel comfortable in? As a general rule, stick to solid colors. Why solid colors, you ask? Well, we want all the attention to go to you. Patterson stripes draw away attention from your face. Choose colors that complement you, and if you have blue or green eyes, wear colors that make your eyes pop. If you're going to have multiple outfit changes during your photo shoot, make sure that you have variety. If you are a girl, you don't want to have one pair of jeans and four different shirts. Instead, you could bring two dresses, a pretty skirt and top, and a pair of cute shorts or jeans. Also, girls, if you're going to be taking photos by the water, bring a flowy dress. They look beautiful by the water. Make sure that you have your outfits pre-planned. You may get to wear all of them, or you may not, but it's best to have options. If you are a girl, make sure to watch out for bra straps and hair brands on your wrist. I personally believe that you should avoid accessories, or at least keep them at a minimum. Girls, if you want to wear earrings, it's best to stay away from big hoops and go towards something that doesn't take away the attention from your face. For shoes, flats are great, heels are great, even bare feet can be great, but tennis shoes and sandals, not so much. So this dress could work over this dress because these stripes are really chunky and these stripes are really busy. So remember, we want all the attention to go to your face. So the big thing with these dresses, this dress is more muted and the stripes really aren't brought to attention while this dress is really busy as well. So, I kind of the same idea. This dress works because the patterns are really big, and they're interspersed, and it's very soft. And this is more harsh, and it's really, really busy. So remember, solid colors photograph best. Choose clothes that you feel and look great in. Replan your outfits. Don't over-accessorize. Avoid small stripes and polka dots, and choose muted patterns. I hope you all have a great senior portrait shoot. Good luck!